The Apostle Paul's greatest desire was to get to know our loving Savior, Jesus Christ, much better. Would you like to know Him? Listen to this devotional. That I may know Him, a devotional by Ellen G. White, Foundation of God's Government. Love worketh no ill to his neighbor, therefore love is the fulfilling of the law. Romans 13 verse 10. The question of deepest interest to each one should be, am I meeting the requirements of the law of God? That law is holy, just, and good, and God would have us daily compare our actions with this, his great standard of righteousness. Only by a close examination of self in the light of God's word can we discover our deviations from his holy rule of right. Love is the principle that underlines God's government in heaven and on earth, and this love must be interwoven in the life of the Christian. The love of Christ is not a fitful love, it is deep and broad and full. His possessor will not say, I will love only those who love me. The heart that is influenced by this holy principle will be carried above everything of a selfish nature. Even among professing Christians, there are persons who are always on the watch for something at which to take offense. If their friends are absorbed in matters that require their attention and have no time to devote to them, they feel slighted and injured. Their lives are like the gorgeous flowers which possess no fragrance. Much to be preferred is the simple, unpretending blossom that blesses with its sweet odor those who come in contact with it. Instead of finding fault with others, these persons should seek out to become lovely by putting on Christ. The character of Christ is the standard which the Christian is to keep before him. His aim should be to possess those graces that are exemplified in the life of Christ in humanity. The religion of Jesus Christ is not merely to prepare us for the future immortal life. It is to enable us to live the Christ life here on earth. Jesus is not only our pattern, he is our friend and our guide. And by taking hold of his strong arm and partaking of his spirit, we may walk even as he walked.